Let's learn how to save or export your videos from the CapCut mobile app to your photo gallery. So if you are using CapCut on your iPhone or Android device and you finished a project which you want to save to your photo gallery, but you don't know how to do it, then watch this video until the very end to learn how to do it. Also, if you're having a problem with exporting videos, then I have a solution for that also, so watch the video until the end to learn how to solve the problem. We'll open the CapCut app and then open the video which we want to save to our gallery. The first step is to click on this 1080p button that's next to the arrow and that's going to open the export settings for us. You can select in which resolution you want your video saved. The higher the resolution, the better, and you can set this to a 4K resolution if you want that crispy video in your gallery. But keep in mind that the higher the resolution of the video, the more storage space that video will take up. So if you don't have a lot of memory on your phone, just keep this at 1080p or 720p. You can also set this to 30 or 60 frames per second, or if you want to achieve that cinematic look with your videos, then set it at 24 frames per second, which is the industry standard. And the last thing is to set the code rate, which is essentially the bit rate of your video. The higher you set this, the better video quality you'll have with your videos. When you set your export settings, just tap on this little arrow at the top right corner and your video will now start exporting or saving to the photo gallery. Once it's saved, you can go to your gallery and share the video with your friends or followers. But what if you click on the arrow to save your video and you get this message that you are using Pro Features and it tells you to join CapCut Pro to unlock all of the features, then there are two ways on how you can solve this. The first thing is to join CapCut Pro and you will be able to access all of the different Pro effects, transitions, fonts, and all other stuff which CapCut Pro users enjoy. However, you will have to pay around $8 per month if you want to get CapCut Pro. If you don't want to pay for anything and you still want your video saved in the gallery, then you will have to remove the Pro features which you had used in the video. That could be video effects, different transitions, some fonts which you like, and similar stuff. So delete the Pro features from the video and you will then be able to save it. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.